check this out. This is the restaurant view. 36 floors up. And this is what they give you to wash your hands, I think. Uh, it smells really good. It smells like a rice and, uh, and like seaweed or something. But I'm pretty sure you don't drink it. Pretty sure. I'm not sure what they were saying, so. <laughs> but yeah, they probably made it themselves. Thank you. Oh, there's our drinks. Orange. Orange. Oh, yes, that's mine. Thank you. Thank you. Go ahead. All right, so I'm going to try this out. This is, like I said, it's a restaurant that, this is, this ginger ale is like the best ginger ale ever. It's like Wilkinson's, never heard of it, but it's got real flavored ginger. And let's try this out. The lady poured out some sake in here. I think, I don't know, I'm not sure if you're supposed to dip it or whatever, but try this out. It's good. That's a good mushroom. The um, spinach there has so much flavor. It's like soaked up all the, um, the soy. And then this is crab meat. Oh yeah, that's good. That is definitely really tasty, so. Since you're just inhaling me. So this, the sake was really strong, by the way. Um, I didn't drink it all, but it was really strong. And burns your throat all the way down, so. But this here is a rice with um, taro and something in, in the middle there. All right, so let's check this out. So this is uh, ginkgo in the middle. And here, we're going to do a quick taste test. It's supposed to be pretty hot. Okay, just that rice is just the rice. Try the arrow. Yeah, it's good. Let's try the ginkgo here. Oh yeah. It tastes like, um... It's just like regular rice, no real depth of pla flavor. This is the soup that it comes with. Okay, check out the view. Um, the soup it has this nice aroma to it. It's like a lemon aroma. So I'm gonna do a quick taste test for you guys. Yeah, it's good. <clears throat> it's good. This is basically lemon skin. Uh, this is some sort of radish and onions or chives. The broth is very clean and has a little bit of that lemon flavor. Alright, so this is the shishimi course and if you look at it, this is plow, uh, that's seaweed, and this is wasabi. So I'm thinking this is real wasabi. This has got to be the, the real stuff. It's not the powdered stuff. So take a, take a quick taste of this. Oh yeah, that tastes so different. That's the real wasabi. Um, it tastes more like a like a vegetable. Um, it has like a like a radish or a, like a daikon taste to it. And this soy sauce might be a little bit different. Let's try it. No, yeah, it's about the same. <laughs> so, and then this pumpkin. I'm gonna try that out separately to give you guys an idea. Or plum. They said. So there we go. Let's try that out. Oh, it's um, yeah, it has no real flavor to it, but let's try it out. Now I'm going to combine them both together. Maybe it brings out the flavor, so let's try it out. There we go. Put it in here. Yeah, it's quite good. The wasabi brings out that sweet taste to it. And the wasabi has a kick to it. So, <clears throat> I just want to give you a little bit of the hint of the texture of the fish. The fish is really fresh, like, when you bite into it, it's got a, like a, 
bouncy texture to it. Um, really good. If you're a fan of sashimi, this is something you have to try. Um, it's different than what we would get in North America for sure. So, this is the next course. This is salmon, taro, um, tofu, I think. That's tofu. And then this is konyaku, they said. And then this is some sort of um, gluten. And we've got uh, tuna <coughs> and avocado. So let's check this out. Let's try the salmon out. Wow, that's good salmon. It's got a lot of soy flavor to it. This here, the tuna. Let's try the tuna. Gotta try the tuna. It's good. This is a taro. There you go. Oh yeah, it's just taro. This is some sort of cucumber, I think. The cucumber, or is it? It's kind of pickled. It's good. Yeah, it's good. So we've got another course here. This is, uh, I think, yuzu broth with um, bok choy and mataki mushrooms and this is some sort of tofu so let's do this is try it out oh yeah that's good it has a nice uh, citrusy flavor to it oh yeah it's really citrusy and there's the mushrooms mm, it's quite good and then i think this is some sort of tofu yeah it's tofu yeah Try and taste this here. Oh yeah, it's good. That's a nice citrusy broth. All right, so this is the next course. So these are um, uh, oshenkos or turnips or plums or something or pickles they called it. And this here is has a nice uh, floral type of almost like a plum smell to it. It's really nice. Um, do a quick taste test right here. Yeah, it's like a, it's like a like plum sort of taste. And that's just rice. Let's do a quick taste test right here, you guys. Oh yeah, that's, it's like a, think of it like a North American uh, pickle or Almost like a relish. That's more, but it's it's not sweet tasting. It's just more sour. That's good. <laughs> All right. So this is the dessert. We got uh, grapes, and then this is some sort of gelatin, lemon uh, gelatin. So let's try this out. Do a quick taste test for you guys. There we go. Oh, it's nice. It's like a nice mellow it's different than what we get in like north america and it's a great boat there it is that is the sweetest grape i've ever eaten that's quite good all right so this is some sort of that's a mochi red bean let's try this out do a quick taste test of it Ooh, that's nice. It has a nice, um, sweet taste to it. And I'm just going to break off a piece. No, I can't. Oh, yeah. It's a nice flavor. Mildly sweet. Hey, guys, check this out. This is real matcha. Just going to see how it tastes right here. Oh, yeah. That is strong. Um, definitely really good, though. Really good green tea flavor. Check it out. I actually prefer, this is really good. It has a nice grapefruit taste to it. 